Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to Forza Motorsport 4. Today is episode number 38. If you guys are enjoying the content, then be sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, and feel free to hit that join button as it really does help support the channel. Hopefully you guys enjoy. This episode was streamed live on YouTube. If you want to make sure to catch the streams, then be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. All right, so we are here now for the Class A European Tour. We're going to be taking part in the Class A European Tour with a Class A European car. Around the Nürburgring, which is a class A European track. No. We're going to be starting off with the Nürburgring, Hockenheim Ring, Mugello, Circuit of Catalonia, and then some Silverstone. Let's get going. What was it? Anakin. I am your father. Yeah. Okay, this is actually quite fun now. We're getting into the fa- Oh my god, the Ferrari just didn't break. <laughs> Poor Ferrari- Oh, it's lost its bumper! No! Oh, the poor Ferrari! Fuck the Ferrari! <laughs> the Ferrari had bottle cap break. Mate, the Ferrari wasn't even a bottle cap. It was just dead. Instant death. Do you know what? I'm going to do a battle royale as well. Let's uh, let's run a battle royale quickly. See who, see who wins. This is a call. Yeah, somebody snipped the uh, Ferrari's brake lines. So the Ferrari had zero brakes. Live without you, but I really don't want to. Still could downshift to engine brake. I mean, that's fair, a fair shout. But if you downshift to engine brake, you end up damaging your engine quite significantly, especially if you're at the high end revs. The track coming back. Who cares? You need to slow down. That's okay. That's a fair shout. That's a fair shout. I don't think the AI was designed to uh, survive. Ah, oh, Heinz won! Way! Let me get back to you. What car did he get, though? Or did he get credit? He got credit. Well, uh, Heinz, if you want to uh, start another battle royale, you can do. <laughs> oh, that's great. Mm -hmm. You got 888. Eight, eight. That's lovely. Don't tell me you're going to spin them all. <laughs> you know the rules and so do I. <laughs> oh, he's going to do it. Let's have a look. Let's see. What's Heinz going to do? Oh, he actually won with it. Okay, fair enough. Coming back. Mm 
Now he can do another battle royale. Nice. Battle royale. Battle royale. Remember, you the only way you can get those exclusive cars is from the battle royale, so... You might want to do the battle royale. <laughs> One v one, bitch. Bam bam. Bam bam. Bam 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 bam. Oh, Heinz is gonna win it! Heinz is gonna win it! Heinz has won it! Way! So, even if you don't get the car, you still get the credits back, but I'd, I'd be surprised if you don't win the car. I'd be so surprised. Heinz has unlocked the Porsche 918! Way! Lovely job, Blair. There's a uh, five minute time limit. Holy crap. This thing's quick. I can't do numbers, that's why. Never mind. Way! Level 6. Nice. I need to work out a way that the bot can detect, like, either linking it to, like, stream elements or something, so that the bot can automatically give. I got a potential emote. Way! Yeah, I need to. What? Oh, that was close. Mech focus. Oh, that'd be a good one. Well, I've already got the mech pog. Did did you screenshot that? If you screenshot it, <laughs> that would be great. I'll do it like that's the focus, the mech focus. We'll call it that. Du, 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 du. Whoa! Skirt, skirt, motherfucker! Dum bum 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 Doing slots again. Way! At least you want some back. That's a bonus. Next 
used to be poor. <laughs> I'm a millionaire. Yeah, I might have to wait. A oh, no. It's actually starting it now. Let's go. Okay, I won. Way. They didn't like the health kits. Where are you now that I need ya? Where are you now? What did I win? I got 500 credits. Nice. I don't need 500 credits because I don't use them. too bad. I actually like how this car drives. It's quite enjoyable. It's quite a good little nippy car. Not bad. Looking good. Car behind is 18 seconds behind. Absolutely destroying the car behind. It's getting warmer and warmer. Genuinely, I'm just sitting here and I'm sweating buckets. t-shirt and black pants. I'll make it even warmer. It'll become like an oven. Oh. Understeered a bit there. So that's a great idea. No, it's a bad idea. Look, look at my hair. I'm sweating already. Like, crazy. My head is moist. 
it is moist. It is wet. We'll burn excess fat. I uh, I need to burn more than excess fat. I need to burn. Burn in the holy depths of fire. Damn! I have chosen to do such a thing. I am taking my headphones off temporarily. I'm just gonna have to pay close attention to the. Yeah, I'm literally speaking. I'm just going to have to pay close attention to the rev counter to make sure that I shift up and down at the right times. Because I can't hear the car. But uh, my, my ears are sweating buckets. Literally, my ears are sweating. That's how hot it is in the UK at the moment. It is fucking roasting, lad. Forty-two degrees Celsius, fifty-two degrees Celsius, sixty-two degrees Celsius. Oh wait, I'm in an oven. Not bad. This is looking good. Seventy-one. My phone literally has a weather warning on it at the moment. Like the weather channel is, it's got a weather warning. Let's dance. No time for romance. You've got me intoxicated. Pretty much. High temperature in the UK, so. It's only an amber, so it's not like super hot, but obviously amber is enough. Uh, our tarmac will start to melt at about 32 degrees Celsius. Like once it gets to about 32, 35, tarmac starts to melt in the UK. Like one, one of our old neighbor's cars literally started to sink into the tarmac that their car was on because we had a couple of heat waves it had been parked there for about 10 years but throughout all like the warming and cooling it ended up sinking into the tarmac like it can sink in obviously our temperature for like 95% of the year doesn't exceed that temperature so it doesn't but like, it, tarmac can go soft. <laughs> like, I mean, there's no need for them to make it durable against extreme heat. Like, it's the ideal parking spot, right? You could be the only one that fits in. Yeah, you literally like bunk. There we go, my car is fully parked. Oh, my phone's going off. Lovely. Run, run, motherfucker!
Whoa, what are you doing? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Whoa! Uh, concrete essentially is just a dozen of compressed small rocks mixed with water when you really see the flight. Exactly. It's just rocks with some glue. And the glue is reusable. It's reusable glue. That's why a lot of tarmac that exists in the UK is just recycled tarmac. Like, tarmac is reusable. You stick it with the... Like, clean off the rocks, use... It is pretty much reusable. Honestly, the UK's roads are... The UK's roads are actually pretty decent, except for when you start getting towards the countryside. That's when it starts looking a bit of a mess. Not bad at all. I'll take that. Across the finish line. I've actually seen some of the rally stages from like the European rallies and the roads actually look really excited. Like, I'll be honest, our roads in the UK are boring as fuck. Like some of the roads in the European rally are just like, can we please have those in the UK? What do you think? The Spanish rally, they've got some quite nice winding Spanish roads. The Czech Republic rally in the ERC, that was fucking awesome. They had like all sorts of different like jumps and stuff on the actual stages. They had narrow sections, they had sections in forests. Belgian GP was pretty good and they've obviously got the cobblestone section that they always go to every year. Which, again, looks fucking awesome. Honestly, like, some of the European stages are crazy. It's my village, the road that goes through the forest that goes up, down, and left, right. That's actually pretty insane. Honestly, some of the rally stages in multiple times I almost got hit from opposite lane. Oh, Jesus. But that's what I find exciting about it. I think it's cool. Like, it's one of those... Those kind of roads are just... Wow. They're beautiful to drive on. I'd much rather have those roads and have to have it destroy my suspension than not have those roads, if that makes sense. Destroy my suspension and my spine. Get rid of it. I don't care. Fuck them. Who needs a spine anyways? With idiot drivers, it's very dangerous to drive. Yeah, I suppose. I suppose you're not wrong. Oh, this alpha looks sick. I'm so excited for the new WRC, by the way, chat. 
like, I kid you not, we're going to be doing a lot of stuff with the WRC stuff. I'm still, uh, I've still got stuff in the works, planning-wise, uh, with streams. I, basically, on Monday, so the Monday coming up, so in two days' time, I'm going to get uh, d Dirt 3, a check map in it. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if Dirt 3 has it. Oh, what, WRC? Ah, sorry, I thought you meant... Oh, you mean like Dirt Rally 3? Ah, that makes sense. Ignore me. Um, I don't know because it didn't have... Oh, wait, hang on. Where's the... Yeah, it's basically Dirt Rally, but it's the WRC one. Um, when does that... There's a, a European rally coming up. I think it's Belgium, Germany, and... I want to... There's another one as well. The, the European rally goes between three different countries. And I'm not sure whether the third country is Czech or not. No, it can't be. It might be? No. It goes through Belgium and some other places. It's a tarmac rally. I think it's Belgium, Germany, and somewhere else. But wherever it is, that one's going to be quite fun. I need to get back into the WRC again. I haven't watched rallies for ages. Yeah, I think it's reflecting on the current season as well. So, 2023. It might be the fact that they just do... Yeah, I mean... I'm pretty... I'm not sure where that three-stage thing's going to be. It could be cool. Uh, yeah, so... Obviously, on Monday, I find out three basically equivalent to two plus weeks worth of streams um almost three weeks i'll have them all planned out um i'm gonna plan out all these different streams the only thing is if i'm doing a subathon starting the 22nd which is going to be 12 plus hours or maybe 24 plus hours Obviously, the subathon, it will be quite good because uh, every super chat and every sub or every um, channel membership as it is on here will add to the timer. But uh, if we do end up hitting one of those other streams, uh, I'm basically running a test today to see how well crossing over from one stream to another is on YouTube. But uh, if it works, it works and I'll definitely be doing it with lots of stuff. We'll have to see. We'll run that test at the end of this stream, which won't be too long, because I'm almost finished the third episode that I wanted to record today, so I've only got one more to do. Paycheck on Monday, I won't be able to pay. Spend a lot. Oh yeah, no, that's fine. That's all good. That is all good. Honestly, I'm struggling with money anyway, so it's a bit to be difficult one. All right, let's try this again after a PC restart. The The cool thing about that, though, is it's so easy to get it back up and running. Like, the stream was so quick and easy to get back running as it was before. So that fills me with a huge amount of confidence for the subathon. The fact that I was just able to reboot it and it was continuing from the stream before. But uh, for that to work, I have to have auto start and auto stop off. But to be honest, having auto start on and off 
Like, having an auto start and auto stop on just makes no sense. If you're trying to make, like, a professional looking live stream. Alright, let's do this race all over again. Going to cry. The airplane flies across the sky. There it goes. It's in your mind. The airplane flies across the sky. There it goes. It's in your mind. <laughs> Don't cry. I will try not to. No promises, motherfuckers! Oh, I'm done with this track already. Why do I have to do it again? Well, at least the next championship's only got three races in it, so it should be nice, quick, and simple. Yeah, PC is definitely having a skill issue. I can tell you that right now. That's the first time that that's happened in a long time, though. Like, where it's just frozen and I've had to, like, reboot. The thing is, when PC works, it works. And it works better than any console ever could. But it's when it doesn't work, PC is an absolute nightmare. I'm going to run a battle royale just because of the fact there's like a, a little apology for the stream crashing. Bad. Two more laps to go. Come on, keep it going. Yeah, you won the Porsche, didn't you? <laughs> Wait, Spring Foxy won. What did Spring Foxy win, though? <laughs> I'm 
the 918. <laughs> Spring Foxy won the 918. Let's go. Here he goes. It's common reward. It's not a common reward. Um, it's... There's six rewards. Never mind, sticking to the SLS. Fair enough. Yeah, there's six rewards. Uh, three of them are 500 credits. And the other three are the cars. Hence why there's 50% chance of getting credits. 50% chance of getting a car that split 33% each way of getting each car. I'm not sure what October's rewards are going to be yet. But I think I might do the... Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure yet. I'm, I'm thinking Supra. Super Supras. And doing like the... Obviously the new Supra. The Mark... Is it the Mark IV? Some other Supras. I'm not sure yet. I think Super Supras would be quite cool to do at some point. And then maybe Evolution of the Evos or something. Mark 4 is not yet. I think it's Mark 4. Eh? Yeah, I might do Evolution of the Evos, and that would be like an Evo, Evo 6, Evo 8, Evo 9, Evo 10. Well, the Evo 10 is already one of the cars along with the WRX, so. True Evolution, that, that could be a good, good name for it. Because at the moment, this is just the, the hybrid trio event, as I've nicknamed it, because they are the hybrid trio. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>